compassionate health care providers educational series. share your testimony as a business partner or what really made you decide to become a business partner. You may share, you may unmute and share. Well, what really made me become really interested in stuff, I tried. I don't know. I tried two different things. I tried the uh, toothpaste that really impressed me because um, oh, I was oh. I, I was using it. I was introduced to it, and I was amazed how it happened because it not just that I was brushing my teeth, but when she told me that you know I could use it on my face. That's what impressed me. That's what got me going. I had a couple of um, issues going on with my face, uh, you know, some uh, scar spots, rather, rashes, because I'm allergic to certain things. And she told me, she said, take it and put it on your skin. I said, toothpaste? I never heard of that. She said, try this toothpaste on your skin. And right on there. And I tried it, and in two or three days, it was gone completely. I went back up there to her shop, and I showed it to her. She said, you see? And I told her, I said, well, if the toothpaste can do that, I'm in. I was signed wow. up, but I wasn't doing anything. So I started, right. I started doing something right then when I saw that toothpaste, because I had never in my life known toothpaste could take rashes out your face. Wow. Now, okay. Now, others want to know, mm -hmm. how did you do that? Did you like smear it on and then leave it on? Or did you literally, let's say, just put it on and add water and, and wash your face? Uh, you know, how did you do that? What I would do, she told me, mm -hmm. she said, clean your face. And uh, I said, with what, regular soap or something? She said, no. She said, I'm going to give you something. She gave me one of those little uh, evening care foam. She oh, told me to wash cleanser. my face. Right. right. She said, wash your face in this and put the toothpaste on it. And I will wash my face at night. And I will put the toothpaste on there. And I will sleep in it. Oh, <laughs> you hear that, everybody? I will sleep <laughs> in it. And then I get up in the morning, wash my face, and about three days yeah. later, I wash uh -huh. my face, and it was uh -huh. like, I couldn't even see it. I'm like, let me see what happened. And I, uh -huh. this, it was gone. It was gone. Wow. And she can testify because I went back up there and showed it to her. Wow. That and I was awesome. amazed. That's when she told her story about the toothpaste, that's why I said, right. I was telling people, I said, I know it worked because she did it on me. And okay. it worked. Okay. Well, thank you very much for sharing that. You, you, you are brave and courageous. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, maybe I didn't hear the other business partners, but you were brave and courageous. Can we get one more business partner? Tell us, share with us, what do you use and that turn you on and say, you know what? I am going to sell this product, share it with others. Can we get one more business partner? I can't hear you. You can unmute your mic. Wow. I know we got some brave and courageous business partners that was out there. 
Yes, I want to share a testimony, Pastor Edwards. This is Beverly. Um, hey, Beverly. One of my friends went uh, on a trip to Alaska uh, last week, and I was led to um, give her a few sticks of the <clears throat> of the um, glucose care, and I gave her some vitamin C, and telling her about the product and everything. And um, so I said, I was led to give you this. And so to make a long story short, on the cruise, she gave me a call. Beverly, I said, okay, what's going on? She said that, um, you know, on the cruise ship, you have all that good food. And so she was helping herself to some of that good food and her sugar went up over 300. And uh, she said, I remember what you told me. And she went and got one of the glucose care and uh, took it and checked her sugar uh, a little while after that. And it was down 200. I know it went out over 100 points. Yes. So, wow. okay, I need to look into this. Yes. And uh, so, but she I have called, so she called you after she came back from the cruise? No, no, no. While she was on the cruise because she was getting sick. And when she remember what I gave her and what I was telling her about our product. And right. uh so yeah, she she uh, yeah texted me and then uh, and then called me yeah and said you know guess what <laughs> yeah right. the sugar went for three hundred then it went down over hundred points and that's the glucose care and I have uh, one of my uh, senior um, uh, clients and uh, well the doctor has taken her off of her diabetic medicine she does the hemohem she does the glucose care uh, she loved the noni. What else is she taking? Um, I know she's doing the one for the belly, the apple phenon and uh, pure tea. Okay. And uh, yeah, so she's been okay. taking it faithfully and they've moved her off some medicine. I mean, taking her off okay. of medicine. Mm -hmm. So what I, what I would like to do is show everyone uh, the glucose care. It's in our, uh, at our, in our global mall. And normally when we hear a testimony like that, we um, explain to people, after you get through eating, take two hours after you get through eating, and then the next day, check your glucose level. And, you know, a lot of times we hear the testimony, oh, wow, you know, they wake up next, it's all normal, blah, 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 this, this, this. But you saying that this person check their glucose level on that same evening you know before she That's went to right. bed right before she went to bed yes it said it wasn't i'll ask her how long away. it wasn't very long after that you right. know and she called and Wait. told me so i said i can't believe this it's gone down over 100 points there so i mean i keep saying wow. points but over 100 right. i know mm -hmm. right yeah, right. and that's over. It it is worth it. It is worth it. Um, yes. you know, one of the keys to to shopping in in this mall is, you know, uh, you can only order under one ID. But if a few of y'all get together and order what you need, order what you need from this mall, you know, and then just split the shipping, just split it. It's much much better like that. But this, um, hey, you know, we were praying they supposed to be getting it in the U.S. mall this year. But they, they made that announcement earlier this year. And oh, some of the things in which they said they was going to get in the U.S. mall, they will uh, get in the mall. Uh, oh, that's now, great. So I'm telling you, man, the same thing. When she get back in town, please ask her, can she come on and and uh, share that testimony with us, okay? Absolutely, I surely will. Because there might be quite a few. And while I'm over here, I just want everybody to know that some of the some of the products that's not in our U.S. mall, um, I believe they are making some adjustment, but they are here. The Alaskan Omega is here, you know, in the mall. Um, Let's see what other product that popped up over here. The Sephora Queen. And also the Saw Palmetto. 
Now the memory up is in the US mall, okay? But you know, especially these two right here. I mean, I use that soft palmetto. Hey, and and uh, and our doctors do recommend, you know, in certain situations, I don't know, maybe on a daily basis, but I know they've also recommended the soft palmetto, you know, in certain situations. Now, while I'm over here, I'm just looking uh, to get the triple omega for kids. Uh, uh, green populus, green populus. We'll probably get one of the doctors to talk about that green populus. Uh -huh. And speaking of, because this green populus is help uh, for the immune system, but this is something that you you can literally take those. I've had those before. Okay, I'm just looking to see how they bought the uh, the eye lutein to the global mall. Because I know in the U.S. mall, they're going to be dis discontinuing it. Definitely. Oh, and I, I hate, let me see. No, I'm not going to say anything. This is not one of the products that really impressed me to do the business. But um, this product right here, I, you know, the first time I used it, which is the shower head, the shower head set, the shower head impress me and it continues to impress me i love it love it love it in my shower i love the way it makes my skin feel and everything it makes a difference and it's good for your scalp too good for you know good for your scalp definitely that shower head vitamin c is a whole food vitamin c too incredible a whole food vitamin c okay now uh before we bring on and uh dr joy uh, okay. dr joy are you here okay before we bring on yes sir I, I did okay before we bring you on i did ask for two business partner testimony but outside of the business partner testimony is there someone that was just kind of anxious to tell a, a, a testimony on today that you've been holding it this week Okay, well, we're going to move right on in and we're going to bring on Dr. Joy Scott. We've been having uh, fun with Dr. Joy Scott these last two weeks. We've been having these events, uh, eating for your blood type, and we've been having like uh, light brunches. We've been having light brunches, which is, you know, a good thing and everything. And um, so, but Dr. Joy, I don't know which phone are you on which one is you on which one is you uh we know that's not you in the kitchen um, okay yeah. i'm on the okay app. iphone yes. yeah the iphone okay as yeah because i didn't want to meet you because i'm i'm on mute duty on today <laughs> uh, okay okay I've so, got, Dr. Joe, oh what would my. you like to share with us on this evening? Well, let me see here. Um, I want to share um, quite a bit with you this evening. Okay. So, <laughs> <laughs> I, um, I guess what I, what I really want to share with you is some of the buzz that's been going on for a while with me, okay? And this buzz is like, what, what should, you know, a lot of people ask the question, what should we be saying to sell atomy? How do we look at atomy, you know, in these new modern times? You know, because if you thought back about six months ago, it's like, please don't talk to me about another network marketing company. And so, what made Atomy just so hot? You know, when something is hot, it's like it's a new end thing to do. But let me just tell you, it is the company that has the most of everything that could really be a game changer in one's health. And over 
all lifestyle. Let me just make that a point. And so, you know, it's looking at your total lifestyle, if that makes any sense. Because we are the first doctors. If we were to just go ahead and admit it, you're not going to the doctor and having that doctor do a guessing game on you and what had happened was doctor you're not even doing that you're not trying to tell the doctor what happened to you you want him to do a total guessing game but guess what we we are like commissioned to help lots of people with their health so that's what kind of i'm just gonna just dig into that just a little bit and let you know you're you know i've been out here for 49 years come november and let me tell you, I think Atomy is a game changer. So I want to spend just a couple of minutes talking about eating properly to complement your supplements. Yeah, that's what I want to talk about. Because, you know, yeah, we're talking about supplements, but how can we complement these supplements and even get greater results and bigger testimonies? We want to just give more. So we know we got the products. So let's add a little value to what can you do also to help yourself further. And so I'm just going to say just about two or three little things for that is like eat for your blood type. Please eat for your blood type. If you're blood type B, then you're not eating chicken anymore. And so, you know, I, I definitely you would never, ever eat protein meat with the carbohydrate like you would never batter your fish in cornmeal or your chicken in flour you're never going to eat gravy with the protein or cheese with the with the with a piece of bread like in mac and cheese and spaghetti with meat sauce and a sandwich two pieces of bread with meat on it you're never doing that ever again that's what we as an atomy group are telling people just so they can feel even better when taking these supplements you're not causing the, the results to be less because you're trying to congest the body with eating wrong foods together it's just the same as washing white clothes with red clothes you're going to mess up those clothes and turn your whites pink let's don't do that so we don't drink when we're eating. You're waiting like 45 minutes to drink. You could have a swallow too, but that's it. You're not drinking down glasses of uh, refillable iced tea with your meal because the digestive enzymes, you'd have to take a digestive enzyme every five minutes while you're eating just to try to get in between and get some digestion done. Otherwise you come in here, we got all this bloating, indigestion, acid reflux because they, the food didn't get digested. So we drink in between meals and 45 minutes after eating even water. So, and we eat for our blood type and we put meats with vegetables. We put um, fruits with fruit and we always put carbohydrates with vegetables. Yeah, and put three hours between a non-meat meal and four hours between a meat meal and please eat. Then the same thing goes like at night. If you're going to eat meat, eat four hours before it's time to go to sleep. So your food would have digested and moved out of the stomach. And three hours before going to bed, if you, if you ate a non-meat meal, wow, that sounds really good. This is like doing things and, and, Taking supplements, I'm going to say right here, let's put that stomach health right here. What does that stomach health do? It manages your food from the time you put it in your mouth until it's exited out of your body. That is just wonderful because we know just starting off, I'm going to put that one little thing that's deep in my talk here, is that we know the first disease of all diseases that cause and create every other disease it's the first disease, and that's constipation, congestion, you could call it, but really they call it leaky gut. That's like the official name. And so what it is, is that leaky gut means that waste, toxins, poison leaked back into your body and created these diseases because of how, hmm, 
how you cause the food to process in your body. It didn't process on time. And so we want you to know what is the process time? You know, so three meals in today means three meals out, I'm going to say, tomorrow. It, you know, it has to equal. You could say three in today, three out today, four tomorrow, four out tomorrow. You are going to equal that. Otherwise, you're going to create a disease. And see, then you're actually taken away from what these supplements, they could do bigger things if they didn't have to fight through the, these healthy, unhealthy lifestyle habits. We are going to change them. We are going to be our first doctor ourselves. Okay. So we want to ask ourselves, what is essential critical nutrients for us to have optimum health and energy? Mm -hmm. And, you know, things like we have trauma in our lives and we have to repair after trauma. You had a car accident or something like that. And, you know, so what's critical to help you detox your body? And all of these areas have to get addressed. Otherwise, you're not going to feel your best. And so when you go to the doctor, the doctor isn't trying to look at all these areas. But because of atomy, we can look after all these areas. What are we going to use for energy? Hmm, we could just take some hemo here. Mm -hmm. What about repair? Nothing heals without enough calcium. Oh, wow. And then what about detox? Well, right now, it's easy. It's called stomach health. So, you know, so when you meet a new person and you're talking to them, you want to talk to them about Atomy, you just think, you know, you say, how are you, you know, how are you feeling? How are you do doing? And so they say, well, you know, I don't feel too good. Oops, you already know there's a first disease. That first disease is really constipation. And you want to just ask them, but you want to be real cool about it. So we've got the stomach health that manages your food from the time you put it in your mouth to the time it exits your body. And if it's not going through properly, it can cause diseases. So are you having like those three, four or five bowel movements per day? And that's a good way. That's how I like to ask it because they said, of course not. I'm having, not having three, four, five bowel movements. They just told you the right answer and you know why they're not feeling their best and you need to get to them to help them, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so let me just tell you a little bit more about these critical nutrients, how you can easily help people and know what they need. And so critical nutrients that you have to have every day are vitamins and minerals, trace minerals, enzymes, hormones. Remember that one hormone, uh, supplement that moved from our U.S. mall over to the global mall. What is it called? Mm, what is it called, Bernard? That pink box. Mm -hmm. And so it is called uh, Queen so Sephora. Yes. And so that particular one helps all your hormones, so either hot flashes or whatever. At Atomy, we've got something for all of these wonderful things that could go wrong in your body. And if it was a man that was having a little hormone thing going on, we could get them the salt palmetto. But we could even use salt palmetto too when we got to do a big job, do a man's job. Get that salt palmetto, it's strengthening up your muscles. And the last one that's critical nutrients for you to have every day resupplied to all those 70 trillion cells is essential fatty acids. Now, let me tell you, I've been importing in the most roughest cut of this for years. Essential fatty acids, that's what your brain is made out of. And we have the best that, um, what is it called? It is, wow, they just moved it too to the global mall. And so I like having it so conveniently for people to have. And so you just take the pill and go on down the road. And so, and you're getting what? Your essential fatty acids that makes up your brain, the omega-3. Mm -hmm. And so 
that one right there, you got to understand, it repairs circulation in the whole body. It repairs nerve damage because, you know, our brain is the biggest, well, it's the biggest nerve, but it is a nerve. And that's what omega-3 does. It balances those nerves and get all the stress off of you. But it helps in so many areas, you know, like in cancer reversal and balancing your blood pressure, reversal of diabetes and removing the stress and increases that sexual performance in men and women. And getting rid of things like bipolar, schizophrenia, works on the retina of the eyes, energy, all kinds of wonderful things like that. And so, um, so here's what else we need with that. Mm. For detoxing, okay, we need water. Mm -hmm. We're going to circle back around and catch up some of these critical nutrients. But we want to talk about water right now. You know, we need all these essential nutrients, plus we have to detox the body. So we need water, a good gallon a day, at least 90 ounces, okay? Plus good soap for the body. And I just love Adamy's Herbal Body Wash. It's called Herbal Body Cleanser. Mm -hmm. And Another one for detoxing, I love the, sto the stomach health. And, um, and another one, that psyllium husk. You know, psyllium husk, you have to understand, if a person's blood pressure is up, my first question to them is, have you been cleansing, detoxing, pooping lately? Because if you haven't been pooping and you're full of poop, then the pressure should be up. Because the body, that blood has got toxins in it. So that's always a question of mine. Mm -hmm. We know that women should have 25 grams of fiber. Men should have 35 grams of fiber every day. And so these are must have, they must have. You know, if you're looking to reverse a disease, you're always detoxing. And that's any disease. Huh, interesting. Okay. Person had a little dehydration. We should have had some water, extra water today. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, this is another little detox I love is you have to add it to it. Before you jump in that shower, on that shower head that has cleaned your water up. What water? Your shower water. Yeah, your bath water. I run my water from my bath through my shower head that Adam may have for you. Wow. Okay, and so, you know, so it's pulling all that chlorine out of the water so you don't have these itching spells and all that and dry skin. Mm -hmm. I love to dry brush my skin before I get in the shower. That's what you can do. You know, we always run into the doctor, but we always did not ask ourselves, what could you have done more? What did you do or didn't do? Well, brush your skin before you go in the shower. You'll see all this white cloud of dust rolling up off your skin. It's like, what is this coming off my skin? Toxins. Mm -hmm. A detox body is a healthy body. Then, you know, you have that big chance of having lots of energy. So get that. Get you a body brush. Mm -hmm. I love bouncing on that trampoline. Everybody's going to say, exercise, exercise. Do you exercise? Do y'all consider exercise as necessary? Yeah, go get your trampoline. It exercises every cell in your body to include your bones. Wow, I love that. And so uh, I would like to have you look at in the anatomy world. And Atomy can take us further than any company I've ever dealt with for total health. I, I gave that secret away earlier, but I decided to make me a few notes so I can make sure that I told you some things that I consider important. Because when it comes down to time 
you want to talk to that new person, but maybe you didn't have all that big confidence yet. But you got to have confidence in the company that you're working with. Let me tell you, think like, mm, I've got the best company. It is just out of me, out of me, out of me. You see what I'm saying? So what you do is, you know, you've got the best company because you've taken a little time and looked at some of your products and it always have at the bottom, at the very bottom, it's more information. Do a little reading, go over to your herbal books, read some more. So what I'm going to say, ask questions, ask yourself questions, ask the person you want to talk to or help questions. And if you truly want to help them, let them close their own sale because they would just answer the questions that you've asked them. Like, how many meals you eat a day? Mm, getting ahead of myself. How many poops you have a day? Mm, is there an odor to your poop? Oh, wow. What questions are they going to ask? Do they need what? Colon health? Do they need psyllium husk? Huh. Do they need probiotics? Oh, they're going to they're gonna just, do they need the, I'm going to, I'm going to say, do they need um, omega-3 even? You know what I'm saying? That's one of my favorites. So uh, vitamin C is my favorite for pooping. You've got to understand if you take at least 8,000 milligrams of vitamin C and those little packs down, don't worry, you'll be in the toilet. Mm -hmm. You better know it. Even the cancer patients use vitamin C in high dosages. How many can you use a day? Those 2,000 packs? You could use eight of those in a day. You will empty out your colon from all the old stuff that's been hanging out in there, causing you to feel sluggish. But maybe you wouldn't do uh, eight, but certainly you could do how many? So the reason I said eight, eight times 2,000 is 16,000. Okay, so if you could have four, four times two is 8,000. No, you need about six to really get yourself moving and get old stuff out. That's 12,000 milligrams. Oh, yeah, you won't be able to hang out there for long, but try taking four to six. And you may try seven sometime. That's 14,000 and just get all the old stuff and start over again by bringing in some fiber, you know, what is a good fruit with the most fiber? Pears, you know, and pears help your heart. So you're letting people close their own sale. Mm -hmm. We've heard so many testimonies on these, on these uh, Zooms and on about every illness. So you, your Indeed. purpose for being here is what? To hear these testimonies and just regurgitate them, tell them, share them with someone else. That's what the whole purpose is, you know? Great. And so let's look at a few products, liver detox. The liver detox your whole body. What product is that? You see, ask yourself, oh, that's milk thistle. Oh, okay. And so, um, so that product can cleanse your liver. You're going to feel full of energy right away. That stomach health is right there in your in your global mall, but please believe me, two or three hundred dollars, easy to order all by yourself. Because guess who need it? Everyone you're going to talk to. Mm -hmm. And so it's yes. time. Excuse me, Doctor. It's time for our ask the doctor part. And okay. Um, and so I want everybody to raise your hand, and then I'll call upon you. Now, I do have a special guest on this evening that had an interesting question. And um, I shared with them the patches, but, but you know, she had mentioned there was some other things that are going on. And I want her to, this is something different, but to prepare to ask this question. And, uh, and I was wondering, like, uh, Billy, are you on? Are you, are you, are you here this evening? Uh, it was yes, Linda's well, I, sister. I'm on. Yes, I'm on. Oh, fantastic. That's that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she had an interesting question, you know, uh, about certain things. It, it might not start with the back, might not be not about back, but she knows. But uh, please ask your question. 
Um, hi, my name is Billy Hill to everyone that's on the Zoom this evening. Um, I have, uh, I've been diagnosed with uh, severe spinal stenosis and um, what the doctor has recommended is the similar surgery. I, I texted my friend today and I said, it's a, instead of telling her what all they're going to do, I say a Tiger Woods situation because they want to. <laughs> Tiger Woods. I like you, okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Tiger Woods situation. That's serious. Okay. Yeah, it's All serious. Right. You know, because uh, what they're they're wanting to do is reconstruct my spine, and um, they'll put screws and pins or whatever in there, and and let that fuse itself to the spine. But that takes uh, about a year. The process is about a year, even though I'll be able to function. Uh, throughout that time. I, it's a six week uh, recovery type thing, but with, you know, after that, then your body is healing from the inside out. So that, you know, that takes time. So my question is, what are you recommending? Do you have any recommendations for spine health? And the answer is yes. The first one is going to be that Alaskan Omega. Three, And like we told you, you may have to go over to the global mall to get it. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you're going to come up with that um, plant-based calcium. Okay. okay. And I would definitely go grab that collagen. I wouldn't order cool. less than three, four boxes of that. Okay. Okay. And so, um, and you have to make sure you've gotten rid of that first disease. Right, right, right. Yes. Which was what? Constipation. Oh, uh, that, <laughs> which brings up another disease you. that I have, which is uh, multiple sclerosis, um, which that's constipation is, is, is one of the problems that you could have with multiple sclerosis and so and, that's something that I deal with okay but guess what so I have really helped lots of people with MS multiple mm -hmm. sclerosis mm -hmm. with that Alaskan omega-3 okay and so the constipation see was your first disease can we get rid of that one because you know what it does it pushes from the inside because the colon is so full mm -hmm. it's pushing forward it's pushing backwards and we got first bits of the space and the the back see it's got mm -hmm. to move it's got to the colon is going to make your back move further out do you see what I'm saying? It couldn't stay in proper alignment. And mm -hmm. especially, have you been an avid exerciser all of your life? I wouldn't say avid all of my life. I'm, I'll be 71 in August if the Lord allows me to live that long. Um, but I, I used to exercise, but now I'm at the point where I'm really almost unable to walk. Um, I stay in the house most of my time, unless it's something I absolutely have to go out and get. And my son, he said, I walk as if tacks are on the floor and I'm assuming they are facing up because I'm trying not to put any pressure on my spine because it, the, the pain is excruciating. Okay. Very. So it's just me and you in the room. And okay. so remember when you're trying to help a person you got to know those those little three questions i like to say how many meals do you eat a day two to how three many, and how many poops do you have a day oh i'm very lucky to have one a day okay and does very it have good. an odor oh absolutely okay so you should have gotten every one of those right if you were trying to avoid a disease at all, mm -hmm. you got me. You right. failed the test. 
So if I was trying to help you, I, it's like, I want to grab your hand and don't let go. Right. Because you would have to have three poots a day. It could not have an odor and it's not happening. And you're now picking your colors and you can have as many colors as you wish. So you got MS and you've got, you added on, uh, what, how many more? Three, four uh, more? I, I, um, woo. Okay. MS, uh, which depression is part of MS. I deal with depression. Yeah. yeah. Um, high blood pressure has nothing to do with MS, but I have. So, it. so, um, it does have everything to do with MS. MS is a big nerve thing. Mm -hmm. It's a nerve brain thing. Right. So your pressure is going to go up. If you're feeling depressed or if you're full of waste. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Gonna, your pressure is going up. How mm -hmm. much water do you take time to drink every single day? I would say about 50 ounces. Okay. And I would say you short about 50 ounces. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> I was listening when you said drink at least 90. Yeah. And so I say, woo. So, I'm yeah, way short. With water. Yeah, you short <laughs> on pooping, short on water, you short on a lot of things. Do you take the Alaskan omega 3? No, I've just been introduced to, I, I got the patches. My sister went to the seminar. And she joined and she, um, where is that package? Yeah, she came yeah. back and helped you. She um, came we, back we shared, and started we, sharing. We shared, some of the, we shared some of the samples of the patches. Mm -hmm. And that that give, that give didn't give, you know, let's say enough, enough relief. So I knew then, you know, she needs some more, let's say, personal attention. As a matter of fact, yes. I would recommend... I would recommend you're probably going to need it. This, this is probably going to be a journey. And, mm -hmm. and uh, I would highly recommend Dr. Joy as a, as a health coach that you walk you through your journey journey. And we all can, uh, you know, walk with you and experience, you know, cause we believe, we believe in for your total turnaround. Oh yeah. Uh, like I said, I would recommend for uh, Dr. Joy to, you know, to be your health coach on this in you know, on this journey because she helps so many oh you know over years and years of time uh, yeah. and so let me say I, this yeah mm -hmm. let me yeah we've turned some lives around we we should have a girl on tonight that had laid in the bed jackie for two years with a stroke only thing that was moving was her eyeballs in her mouth how oh, you like that story and mm -hmm. it took it took it probably took about 12 16 weeks mm -hmm. and she's now back to total life she's doing everything anybody could do line dancing driving you name it mm -hmm. paralyzed from the neck down not one side was working Ooh, mercy. You, you understand me mm -hmm. so the spinal stenosis is like I had a girl that developed that. It was like, you could watch her develop it. She was working for one of those big magazines. It could have been Essence Magazine, okay? They said, don't move out of your chair, away from your desk. Look, I, I wanted to say 18 hours, baby. They mm. stayed on that job because they had to get the, that magazine out. Like, mm. no, we're bringing your, your lunch and dinner to your desk. Don't move, don't move. <laughs> And the next thing you know, here she is. She couldn't move. Mm. You know, the less you move, the less you are going to be able to move. Yes, and that's one of my um, big concerns. But what I would like to say um, that I did try the patches. Um, and um, although it didn't help with the severe back pain that I, I deal with, I can say... Uh, for for me, it any uh, minor or moderate pain that anyone is experiencing, I, I think that is it, it's just an awesome product. Um, it just really, really, you know, it, it's just a good product, and I really truly enjoyed what it did for me. 
although it didn't deal with my particular Oh, pain. it can. It can, though, Jackie. You've Billy. got to get the <laughs> first problem. you got to start working on what even let the floodgate open to the problem. And that still is a big problem just this moment, constipation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and it's just like you take your, your fist and ball it up and your, mm -hmm. your arm is coming out from your side with your fist extended, mm -hmm. your arm extended out with the fist. What if mm -hmm. you took your arm and pushed it back? Somebody's standing right behind you and you just pushed it back. It's mm. like you're getting elbowed. Mm. That's what's going on all the time in your abdomen area, like around where the belly button is and mm -hmm. a little bit lower than that. Your guts are so full of waste, it's pushing on your back, pushing on, and it stays there. Mm. It stays pushing on your back. So you stay hurting. Move that waste out. You need some vitamin C some omega, the Alaskan omega-3, some calcium so we can start repairing some stomach health. That's how we think with the Atomy team, that we have to, it takes a little bit more than one little thing and see that's topical, but what is really causing the problem? I do know this as a fact about those patches. It will put you to sleep instantly, almost. <laughs> And yes. so, and so if you, if you're hurting, you could put a patch on the stomach back and then put that piece under both feet. You could get through the night, but we still didn't handle the actual cause of the problem. We're not yes. drinking enough water to soak the colon so that the colon could have a chance to move. And what blood type are you, Jackie? This is how we're selling people. And I'm only saying this right now because this is how we all should address it. So we can all get A's. You get an A because you got rid of your pain. I get an A because I help move you from sickness, pain into health. See, mm -hmm. I've, I've like that MS. I worked mm -hmm. with the recruiter of a college. She had MS. And I thought, you're the most important person on this campus, girl. And you've got MS. You know what I fed her? I fed her uh, um, the omega-3, the Alaskan omega-3. And I fed her that one. And we fed her like the B-complex. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the ginkgo biloba for circulation in the brain. And let me tell you, she's still top everybody she was the best recruiter ever mm -hmm. and without complaints mm -hmm. and you know and right. and yeah so no circulation no weakness in her legs none of that mm -hmm. you, so we've got That's the true. supplements but guess what she definitely mm -hmm. had excellent bowel care so you got to get that stomach health. So we just need to get you some right. supplements, the critical supplements in your kitchen, in your pharmacy, in your house. Understood. Yes, ma'am. Understood. Ma and you, you asked what? about my blood type. I'm an, uh oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. What on. blood type? Uh oh. We want to know your blood yeah, we, type. We, we, can, we can hear you. Okay, I'm an O positive. Oh, yeah. So we already know you couldn't have any wheat, white wheat, whole wheat, no cornmeal, no grits, no popcorn. Are you eating <laughs> any of those? Bad me. <laughs> uh. So there's no sandwiches for you. There's no grits. You see, there's no cereal. Oh, no, you are hurting me so bad. Oh, no, you are hurting you. No. you see, you're, see, who would we blame for you not knowing, Jackie? We all take the blame. We want you to be well. So we would send you the protocol. We'll mm -hmm. send you the protocol, what you need. Mm -hmm. 
Let and so open. then we will make sure you get at least the four or five critical supplements to complement mm -hmm. your diet. And you need your blood type book. So you only eat your foods. How about that? Uh-huh. It's so interesting. I, I um, was just perusing the internet and um, I don't know if I saw something or it just came into my, my mind. This is about two or three days ago before Linda gave me the patches about the blood type. I remember seeing the blood type diet and I think I must have seen something like that. And, and it was like a home, you know, one that that really, really works. And let me tell you, it really, really works. <laughs> I'm a blood type O myself. And mm -hmm. that recruiter of that college, she was a blood type O too. Mm -hmm. The blood type O. And so when she, her body got the right things, mm -hmm. it just Ever saw another symptom wow. to that MS? Yeah. yeah. So we want to welcome you home, baby. We well, want you to you have your book. So I don't know who is your person. Your sister is your person. And she's going to yeah. help you get your book. So you can cry some big tears, ask yourself to forgive yourself. <laughs> and... You're yeah. sorry for not learning earlier about yourself, but you can raise really love on yourself. And thank you for being big enough to jump on this call, this uh, Zoom tonight, to find out for yourself. We love you. Yeah. And you know what? Indeed. I've got to go myself. And so <laughs> uh <-oh. laughs> I've got to go jump on another call. So uh -oh. um we love you, and I want to hear from you. Okay, okay. wonderful. Sounds yes. like a plan. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank uh -oh. you. You guys have a good evening. Thank you. Thank okay. You. Thank you, Dr. Joy. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hey. So, okay. So right now, I, I believe I saw uh, Dr. Springer. Dr. Springer, are you still there? I am. Okay. Um, Dr. Dr. Spring, we did have a couple of questions that was in the uh in the chat. And uh and but I'm gonna I'm gonna answer this. It says what is good for insomnia, get those pain patches <laughs> and, and put, you know, just cut off let's say uh uh an inch. Now make it two inches and put them on, on the bottom of your left feet and right feet. And uh, you'll sleep all through the night. I, I'm, I'm telling you, you know. Uh, but we have a few questions that's in. Would you uh, serve on this morning? Serve us on this evening by answering a few questions over in the chat. Okay, let me get there. Um, okay. The omega three it, it is usually in our mall. I think we're just out, but you can get it from the global mall. First of all, there's a couple of things on there people are saying about that. You may have to give it a minute. Um, the, the reality is we're selling products. And so they got to figure out a way to keep up with the inventory. All right. But um, right. you can get it. You can get it. Um, okay. There is also a question here. What is good for weakness in your legs? That could be a circulation issue. So you can use um, that hemohem. You can use that plant calcium. Um, you can use that advanced omega-3. All of those things is going to help with the circulation, okay? Um, there's another about sleep problems. We've already discussed the patches. The other thing that you can do is the good sleep. Um, that's on the global page. And you can also, while you're over there, get the tart cherry. It has uh, natural melatonin in it. So you can get the tart cherry sticks as well as the good sleep from the global page to assist you with your sleep. And then just some regular, you know, homework things. Turn off everything. Put the phone in the other room or in the drawer on the other side of the room. All right. And give yourself a moment of peace and quietness, um, you know, before you go to sleep. But shut it down. 
all the lights and things of that nature. So you'd be surprised at how that helps. Um, there's a question in here. Um, okay, you're welcome. Good for throat cancer. All right, hemo him, hemo him, hemo him. Six packs a day, two in the morning, two in the afternoon, two in the evening. Get off the sugar, get off of meat. Meat is very acidic. Cancer loves sugar. Cancer loves meat. The longer you can do, um, or the majority of your meal, if you can do the majority to complete, raw, go raw, juicing, um, smoothies, vegetable smoothies, um, vegetable and fruit juices, but get off of the sugar, take your heme on him. And the body has to exercise and get a lot of oxygen. Cancer does not like sugar and cancer does not like oxygen. Okay, so the more you breathe, take a moment, and it's a good thing for all of us every day. We don't breathe enough. We don't use the maximum capacity of our lungs. And I have actually done exercises with people where we just sit and breathe and exhale, and people get lightheaded, okay, because their body is not used to taking in that level of oxygen to the brain. But breathe. Take a walk. Sit and be still, breathe, be still and trust that God is God is healing you, but use your hemo him, okay, and use your um food. Let food be your medicine, okay, but make sure it's not the wrong food. Um, what else is here? Oh, the name of the Dr. number. Dr. Springer. Yes, sir. Excuse me, Dr. Springer. All right. Here's a hidden secret. The toothpaste. Gargling with the toothpaste. Excellent. Remember the, uh, yeah, remember that the lady, yeah. uh, yeah. uh, a few months ago? Well, yeah. more than a few a months ago. Healed. Yeah, that's right. good. Uh -huh. Thank you. Hmm? Okay, so yeah. the the toothpaste and the um, gargling, you, you can dilute that toothpaste in some water. Just brushing your teeth with it is great, but you can dilute that toothpaste in some water and let it dissolve and gargle in it because the B-Cropolis um, is, is good for healing um, the cancer. Now, please understand, and you can use the spray as well. That would help you. But please, for because of the cancer, you will need to avoid the honey right now. No sugar, none at all, okay? Thank you, um, thank you. And you that was that was your testimony. That that <laughs> we, we had a um, we had a I could top that moment um, at our last um, meeting. Um, well, at the at the meet last one I was at, I'll say it that way. And um, uh, Bernard, won, he won that one. Mr. Strozier, he, he won that. One. <laughs> We were talking about <laughs> testimonies concerning the toothpaste, and we all thought we had something going on. And he said, I could beat that one. And so he talked <laughs> to us about the lady who had sores in her mouth because she had cancer. And from taking the chemo and things of that nature, she wasn't able to eat. She really wasn't able to handle anything in her mouth until she started using the toothpaste. And within a couple of days, um, he said her testimony stands that it, it healed those sores up in the mouth. So definitely, that is definitely uh, a top one for the throat cancer question. Okay. Did I miss anything else um, here? Uh, well, oh, uh, okay. Okay. Swelling of the feet. The swelling of the feet. You need water. You need circulation, you need that omega, that ginkgo um, nettle, and you need to move. You got to get up and move, get that water off of you, okay? Get that water. Some people think, well, if I'm retaining water, why do I want water? Well, the body is made up of water. And so anytime you have stagnated water, move the rock so the, so the clean water can come through and flush it out. You need water, but use the hemohem, use the, um, the same thing we talked about to get that circulation in the legs will help with the circulation in the feet. The most important thing, though, is that you move. You've got to move. You've got to get up 
and get active. Most of the time we sit still and like, you know, Dr. Joy talked about the person who was ordered to sit at their desk all those hours. You got to get up and move. If you sit at a desk, get up and take a, you know, get up and do some walk, jogging or walking in place for a minute or under your desk, move your knees and legs up and down. But also lay off of um, the foods you shouldn't have. It, it really does have a lot to do with what we eat, okay? Confession, I, I, I'm i not a huge meat eater, but I had a ball the 4th of July. I was grilling and I was carrying on. And it, I'm like, oh my God, I had the worst two or three days after that. And I'm like, girl, you know better. You know, so we, okay. we go on these, you know, in all honesty, but you got to know what to do. You get, you get off track, get back on track. Don't just stay derailed, get back on track and do what, do what we need to do. Our conscious tells us what to do. Stop ignoring your, your inner peace. Stop ignoring your, your, um, what you know. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, uh, um, Actually, we'll I'm work for you. You're going to, you're going to, you're going to be next. Also. Yeah. We'll work for you. You're going to be next. But we, someone asked about neuropathy. Neuropathy. Neuropathy is damage to the nerves as a result, usually of diabetes. And I am told it is very difficult to reverse. So what you want to do is stop it so it does not get worse. I don't know. Um, personally, I feel like anything can be reversed. That's that's me. All right. Uh, I am told it is very difficult to reverse. So what you want to do is stop it. You got to get the circulation going. Um, and listen, we are very holistic. The reality is, though, if you need to check your blood sugar levels and you don't, but you consistently take uh, prescription medication, that doesn't make sense to me. Why are you, you check your levels so you will know what you're doing, so you know what you have, so you know what you need to do. Get on that glucose care. Remember, we talked several months ago. Those of you that I knew on here, I know you would not remember, but several on here are on here a lot. You're going to take glucose care for maintenance. Okay, you're going to take it for maintenance. You're going to take it to keep, to make sure that you don't cross over that uh, number. You want to keep that A1C under five. Okay, um, you don't, when it starts creeping up towards 6.5 and all that, and they start saying you, you're pre diabetic, listen, personally, I think you are or you're not. But at the end of the day, listen, take the glucose care, take it, it works, it helps. The glucose care, and remember, we have a testimony on our um, YouTube page about the young man who his A1C was always eight and above. And at the time, that he in this testimony he doesn't even talk about glucose care he talked about him on him and he someone talked him into it he started taking it and he couldn't take the glucose medication from the doctor because it made him ill so it was always expected when he came in that his a1c would be eight he got on it and in about three months three to four months time when he went back it had dropped Okay, I'm sorry, I just said that all wrong. It was 14, and when he went back, it was eight. And at 14, they couldn't figure out why his body hadn't started shutting down. And so what did you do? He did hemo him. He doesn't even talk in that testimony about the glucose care. Now we have the hemo him and the glucose care. Come on, let's take it. Take it, take it, take it. Excellent, dude, excellent. So uh, we'll work one ask, and when you say get rid of sugar, does that include sugar from fruits? No, it's it's different. It breaks down in your body different. That's natural, okay. And that's that's a that's a good question. Um, see, the body recognizes sugar from fruits. The body does not recognize. Uh, the body recognizes also sugar cane pure, but our sugar has been processed, bleached. The body doesn't recognize it, which is why the pancreas don't know what to do with it and, and eventually stops functioning. No, we're not talking about sugar from fruits, but what I will say is do your fruits in the morning, all right? If you're going to snack on something in the evening, um, you don't want it to be a lot of food, maybe a piece, you know, a half a piece, but 
you because you want to you want the body to go to bed really with your stomach already having had digested all right for the evening so when you lay down that also affects your sleep for those who was asking questions about sleep when you when you um too much is laying in the digestive tract and have not been carried to the proper place it will affect your sleep you're tossing and you're turning all right, acid reflux, burping, uh, all of those things. So bloating, a good night's sleep also means that you want your stomach to be, um, everything in the digestive tract to be processing, um, functioning normal, okay? And processing yeah. as it should. Right. Mm -hmm. And someone has, and this will be the, uh, I apologize, this will be the last question for the evening, okay? So I'm gonna read mm -hmm. it slowly. Okay. What uh, pinched nerve, bulge in spine, herniated disc, and sciatica? Okay. Y'all need to come to my massage parlor. <laughs> right. Uh huh. Definitely. <laughs> and let me walk oh, on you. Right. No. Over um, they located oh, in Georgia. <laughs> All right, seriously. Evangelist, are you located in Georgia? <laughs> <laughs> my, my, my. All right, you yeah, want definitely. to. Okay, sciatica. And someone also was talking here, I see, about the patches. Yeah, the patches is definitely good for pain. That can help with um, the pinched nerve, the sciatica, the things of that nature. Um, but Dr. Joy has already uh, really covered this very well tonight. If if you are okay, I'm I'm a short person. I'm just five, one and a half, and I claim my half, all right? <laughs> my, my, my. Yeah. Okay, what happened? Colon. That means it's core. Colon is core. We have an upper stomach and a lower stomach. And now if we are not properly eliminating, we're bulging out in the hips, in the stomach, against the spine. Against the against the muscles and the nerves, we need a detox. So if all those things are going on, then you need a detox, and you need to drink your water. And we do need to be moving, move, go. If you have, let me tell you, there's nothing wrong with a gym membership, but we got parks, and better than that, open your front door, your garage door, your back door, your patio door, and walk out of it and don't come back until you've gone 15 minutes away from the house now how are you gonna get back home you got to walk 15 minutes back okay so because product, that's uh, food. that's going to help you drink your water take drink your water before you leave take your water with you drink your water while you move it and as she said coat that colon so that it has to move get your fruit in the morning get that fruit in a pair a day is very good um get your fruit in do the things that that's going to help you we have a um i'm going to open it if it's okay uh i have a 21 day challenge starting next week um if you if you're interested um text me or you know contact me because we we all got to get to moving we got to get right. to moving yeah. we got to get, get there is new jersey there in new jersey Okay, they can, they can do the 21 challenge in New Jersey, get four or five okay. friends together, weigh in, write down what everybody weigh, whoever loses okay. the, the largest percentage, everybody pay their $21 and the person gets the pot at the end. Now we can all do that. You don't have to come to me. You see what I'm saying? You ain't got to come to me. You ain't got to find, everybody can join in on this challenge from wherever you are. Okay. Get three or four friends with you and let's be between now and the end of august let's make a difference because once we let's be honest once we start moving into the winter months you know we you know we get off the chain let's let's take care of this before thanksgiving all right and okay just challenge yourself challenge okay. yourself okay. okay you put your number uh, in the chat because there's they're asking for your number uh and a couple of people's interested in that challenge um so please put your number in the chat yes sir right mm -hmm. right so while she's doing that you know we've got quite a few people that are on here and um 
got quite a few on on there. She's put her number in the chat and everything. And we're going to take our time. And those that want her number, stay on here. We're going to get ready to say good night, John Boy. It's been good. Uh, we will be uh, loading this program up. Uh, and you can go to the uh, website and review it.